If you look how water is distributed across our landscapes, then you see that the whole landscape is influenced by the water, all the processes. The importance of water in human life, you see that all our activities are somehow directly or indirectly linked to water. So my name is Stefan Schmutz and I'm the Vice Head of the Institute of Hydrobiology and Aquatic Ecosystem Management. Enology was a part of many other master programs and also bachelor programs at the Boku. But then we realized we have to develop an limnological master program at the Boku. So limnology uh, in general is part of the, of, of the ecological sciences, trying to understand the interaction between the environment and the biota in, in inland waters. Uh, my name is Thomas Hein and I'm uh, the head of the institute uh, since 2019. So applied limnology in its core addresses the issue of uh, how can we solve these challenges we face right now. The program is quite dense, so we do have a lot of courses, a lot of field work, so you can enjoy also different uh, environments in Austria. I love the excursion. It's a good uh, really feeling to be really one week uh, enjoying outside and doing practical things that i never done before, so that's the best thing that I really enjoyed it and I learned a lot also. I I saw completely new and different things I've never done before, like snorkeling in a river. So you learn not only from the lectures, but you also go in the field and learn a lot about how to, to do those things you learn. For me it helped me really a lot to understand the morphological processes in the river because you see the seed with your own eyes, the sediment transport, how the fish behave, how the, the caddisflies build up their, their house. But I also like to take the data and think about the outcomes. When I look at the curriculum of the biology, I really like that it was really a lot of details about yeah, macro and fish and water chemistry, which is what I like. So there is the chance that you select and you approach people and you select topics uh, and you really define what means uh, limnology and aquatic sciences for you and then you can really drive uh, along uh, and, and enjoy this path you, you select. Whether I'm going more into uh, you know, the, the plant side or the animal side, or I'm going more into the planning side, or I'm going more into the biogeochemical side. Uh, it's, a, it's a program called uh, Completely in English. We have an uh, international group of students. The cool part about the program is that you can, you can go to Kenya if you want, also to the Netherlands. Studying the knowledge at the Boku is a challenge and a chance. I think this is a, a big opportunity for students. They can really learn a lot and profit from experienced people. You will get a lot of support by your supervisors. We have a large team of experienced and young scientists. And they, they are united uh, by one important thing, about the passion working with aquatic ecosystems. It's a little bit like family and everybody knows each other at the institute and they all, there's always somebody who helps you. The feeling is very like being in a big family. Especially if you're not Austrian and not European, I think this is very nice because you really need a bit of social support when you come. If you're interested in doing a lot of field work in an international context, studying in English, improve your English as well, have a lot of open doors around the world, then you really should do that. Oh yeah, I would choose it again. I think it was a, a good decision. The challenges are still out there. Uh, we cannot only talk about 
climate crisis. We need to uh, uh, address uh, the crisis of uh, of species extinction. So we have a, a biodiversity crisis as well. Freshwater systems are in the forefront of, of systems being affected. The species are endangered. The habitats are destroyed. Uh, we do not get the benefits, the ecosystem services from our rivers and lakes that we want to have. So there is a lot to do, a lot to improve. And we need young scientists, we need young engaged managers that contribute to this process of steadily improving our environment.